The national leader of the All Progressive Congress, APC Bola Tinumbu, and his close aides are not happy with the pictures released by the presidency showing the former Lagos State Governor with a walking stick when President Muhammadu Buhari visited him in London, United Kingdom. He so stood Sahara reporters on Friday. Presidential aide Basha Ahmad posted some photos on Facebook on Thursday and captioned them. President Muhammadu Buhari, this evening in London, the United Kingdom visited Ashiwa Jubola Ahmed Sinumbu. In the photos, Tinumbu was seen leaning on a walking stick as he posed for shot with the president. Buari visits in London as ex Lagos State Governor recuperates with use of walking stick after second surgery, according to Sahara reporters. Tinumbu and his people are not happy that President Buari brought NTA, Nigeria Television Authority Government owned station, and others to visit him. He source to Sahara reporters. When Lagos Governor Babajide Sonwulu and Abiodun Faliki, federal lawmaker, visited him, nothing revealed he had a surgery or was sick. But the way Buhari and his photo ops handled by the villa was not what he, Tinumbu, bargained for. The feds betrayed that such pictures showing him with a walking stick would be released. Note that all the pictures were released by the presidency. Sahara reporters at Omonde reported that Tinumbu Odan went a second knee surgery at the Jock Oxen University Hospital in Maryland, U.S. The APC chieftain, it had been learned, left the U.S. for the United Kingdom on crutches a few days after the surgery. Tinumbu had had a second surgery at John Oxen University in Maryland recently. He was accompanied by a popular Nigerian doctor in Chicago, a source had said he had wanted the surgery in paris but when rumor was right about his death he hurriedly left for nigeria and went to john Upton. he left the uk he left the us for the uk on crutches sir reporters at on july 31st reported that sinumbu who has had several medical trips this year alone had a surgery about two weeks earlier and could be billed for another one the APC national leader has been off official and party functions in the country for a while. And Miss talks that he is being positioned for the 2023 presidency to succeed the incumbent repressive regime of Buhari. Sinumbu is hospitalized in Maryland, U.S. His head is failing. He couldn't practice in launching his Arewa library. And he couldn't participate in the local government area elections last week. He could not attend today's APC Congress due to health reasons. He had a surgery last week, an authoritative source had disclosed. A few days after the story, photographs of Tinumbu hosting Governor Babajide Sonwulu of Lagos State in London surfaced where the duo were seen together in a room. Reports have it that the meeting was held to put an end to speculations around the APC national leader's health status. In January 2021, Tinubu was also reported sick and hospitalized in Paris, France. Tinubu had earlier complained of exhaustion and traveled out to rest before the news of his collapse went viral. He was flown to Paris for medical attention in the first week of January. Sahara reporters at on June 15 reported that Tinubu was also in Paris battling with some old age ailments. Tinumbu is in Paris, France for a medical checkup. His head is deteriorating, old age and other stuff, but he still wants to be president. This could mean another medical tourism presidency for our country. It's up source at at that time revealed. Sarah reporters had reported the conspicuous conspicuous absence of Tinumbu during the one day walking visit of President Mohamed Buhari to inaugurate various projects in Lagos State. Earlier, the president's spokesman, Gaba Shewu, had tried to downplay the obvious rift between the two leaders and their camps, saying the interview the president granted to a rice interview where he mentioned Lagos was not about Tinumbu, saying you cannot sit there in Lagos, for instance, and decide on the fate of APC on zoning. Buari had said while responding to a question during the interview. 
the hope of this administration is to see APC last beyond it. Therefore, we should allow the party to decide. The restructuring of the party has begun from the bottom to the top with the membership card registration. Every member of the party must be involved. We will soon conduct our convention. No single member of the party will be allowed to go against the wish of the party. She had maintained that there was no rift between the two leaders and that the reference to Lagos had nothing, nothing to do with Tinumbu. <laughs> so they are not happy that uh, Buari released that. So that means Buari betrayed them. That they didn't know that uh, Buari brought an uh, NTA to video or whatever. Let them, all of them, uh, let them continue with all their deceit. So at, at this level, so what they want, just like a uh, Buari has already achieved his aim, just to become the president, he, he, he has nothing to offer. He, he, of course, everybody can see it. Just to answer that name, that he was a head of state and at some point he was a, a president under democracy. That is just all he wanted. You can see that he's not even bothered about the happenings in the country. He's not happy about it. He's not bothered, rather. And the same thing with Tinubu. Tell me what they, what they want. They are, very, they, are just, they are just disgracing themselves. Honestly, at this their old age, they have not been able to do anything for Nigeria. They will be telling you, oh, Lagos has done this. Lagos has this IGR here and there. At the end of the day, what can, can, what can we pinpoint that is happening in Lagos? Lagos is just, is just there. Nothing is happening. No development whatsoever. Everything is in disarray. Everyone is suffering. Common traffic, they cannot even get it done. Where is the infrastructure? Nothing. People are suffering. The Lagos money, where is it going to? A lot of talks here and there. Your guess is as good as mine. You know what we are talking about. You talk about Nigeria, you see what is happening. And yet, these people cannot face this country. They are sick. They are moving from place to place. Some people are saying, oh, maybe they are afraid of not being, 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 being I don't know, um, dealt with. That is why they are running. You know, there is no peace for the wicked. Because if you have done the needful, if you have done the right thing, I don't see no reason why you'd be afraid of people, your own people to treat you, moving from pillar to post. See, see the two of them. Of course, you can see them in the picture. See, see, see how they, are, they, are, they have turned these countries into. Are they, are they not worse than PDP? No, they are preparing him for 2023 election. After fortifying him, he will come back and begin campaign. Only God knows the next president, not even Buhari, God has rescued Nigerians from Abacha's tyrannical ruling. It's still there for us to res rescue Nigeria as a nation from the wicked, ambitious so-called leaders. Just imagine what would have happened to that guy if this man was the president of Nigeria with all the powers of coercion and enforcement. He can't even take zero zero points, whatever, whatever of the um, of what he dizzies us to other presidents, Buhari and Co. Sinumbu and his Deluded supporters still think Bukwari and his Fulani henchmen will hand over power to him in 2023. Where we Tinubu now tell the world who is in Asuro, probably not the Afonja of our time. We all know. A good body language reader on this platform will tell you categorically that Buhari was indirectly shading Tinubu for the reasons below. One, he puts his two hands behind his back. He was looking up despite the fact that he is taller than Tinumbu. Three, E. Buhari smile scornfully in that picture. A typical mind reader will tell you what was going through Buhari's mind when they were taking that picture. He was saying to him that look at this one that wants to rule Nigeria. <laughs> what is the big deal? Oh, maybe they showed Nigeria the pictures to pass a message across that it's not fit to contest for 2023 presidential election. You know these guys are smart. Buari camp are wise people. It is to truncate Tinubu ambition of becoming president because he knows if he becomes one, Nigeria will become his properties. And that is what Fulani man will not want to see. So guys, let's hear your opinion and have your take on this.